I'm Tony from Bonner's Piano Centres and this is my buyer's guide for Yamaha's new flagship Clavinova Digital Piano, the CLP885. Now in this video, I'm gonna give a brief overview of the piano's most important features that you should consider if you're thinking about purchasing a new top of the range digital piano. With prices at launch starting at just over £4,000, there is, as you would expect, a lot to look at with an instrument as advanced as the CLP885. I intended to make this a short introductory video, but the more I played this piano, the more I realised there are so many features to talk about that it deserves a full length video to do this magnificent piano justice. So I've divided this video into sections to ensure I cover the most important features that you need to know, including keyboard action, sound, cabinet design, Bluetooth and apps, and onboard recording functions. If you don't want to watch the whole thing and you're watching on YouTube, you'll find timestamps in the description so you can jump to the bits that are of relevance and interest to you. If you're confused or unsure about the meaning of phrases such as grand expression modelling, GP response pedals, counterweights or escapement, I'm going to try and explain all of these features in an easy to understand way while giving you some really good playing examples of the sounds that this instrument can produce. So make sure you're listening through a nice pair of speakers or earphones. The CLP885 has just arrived in Bonner's showrooms this week, so you're very welcome to come and try it for yourself in store. We're proud to be Yamaha Clavinova agents in all three of our showrooms, which are located on the south coast in Eastbourne, Rygate in Surrey, which is just two miles from Junction 8 of the M25 motorway, and in Milton Keynes, which is within easy reach of the M1 and A5 main roads. Now, all of our stores are located out of town and have plenty of on-site parking. Buying a new piano of this quality and value is a serious matter and it's important that you make the right decision. We believe that Bonners without doubt have the best digital piano showrooms in the UK with knowledgeable friendly staff and a relaxed atmosphere. You can compare the entire range of Yamaha instruments alongside pianos from other manufacturers all under one roof to ensure you're making the right buying decision. We also offer part exchange options for your existing acoustic or digital instrument and UK wide delivery options to make buying your new piano a hassle free experience. Yamaha markets the CLP885 as being the pinnacle of the Clavinova CLP series, which is their premium range of digital pianos. They say it offers a blend of advanced digital technology and traditional piano craftsmanship. And Yamaha is one of the very small number of digital piano manufacturers who also make acoustic pianos. So they understand the connection players have with acoustic instruments and use their expertise in acoustic piano manufacturing to ensure their digital instruments are just as enjoyable to play as an acoustic piano. So let's jump right in and listen to the first piano voice when you power on the CLP885, then we can examine its features in more detail. One of the two most important considerations when choosing a new piano is the key touch, which is how it feels when you play the keys. Of course, the sound is also very important. I'm gonna cover that in more detail shortly, but the keyboard is the very first physical interaction you'll have with the instrument before you even hear the sound. And that's why it's so important that you choose a digital piano that feels right for your own playing technique. Even if you're a beginner, you'll certainly appreciate the difference in feeling between the keyboards on various pianos. And in fact, the keys on the entire range of Yamaha digital pianos vary significantly in how they feel. 
So that's why we always recommend you come to a Bonners Piano Centre in the UK to try various models to ensure it feels right for you. And this is very important if you're an experienced pianist. The CLP-885 is fitted with Yamaha's Grand Touch keyboard with wooden keys and synthetic ebony and ivory key tops. When you play the keys on an acoustic piano, it's possible to press them really gently and still produce a note. Now, many digital pianos can't do this because the key needs to hit the bottom of its travel in order to trigger the sound. Yamaha has changed the algorithm that controls the sensors on the CLP-885 and it's now possible to trigger a note without reaching the full depth of the keybed. And my goodness, this is a real game changer for me. And it means you can play extremely soft and delicately with all the expression you would achieve from an acoustic piano. And this is a key difference from the previous generation CLP-700 series. And I can honestly say that playing the CLP-885 is a really engaging experience. The escapement mechanism recreates a subtle click felt when pressing keys very lightly, just like an acoustic grand piano, and it also helps with delicate playing techniques. There are 88 keys, just the same as an acoustic piano, and every key has a simulated hammer mechanism, which adds to the authenticity of the keyboard. This is known as a linear graded hammer system, and it replicates the bass note's heavier feel and the treble octave's slightly lighter touch. Finally, Yamaha has added counterweights to balance the weight and improve the touch response of the keys. By placing small weights inside the keys, counterweights provide a more even and consistent resistance across the entire keyboard. And this ensures that the keys are not too light or too heavy, which allows for better control and expression. I find that the additional weights help achieve a smoother and more balanced touch, especially in faster passages. Yamaha has not only worked hard on the keyboard action in the CLP-885, but they've also improved the physical feel of the pedals, particularly the damper or sustain pedal. If you play an acoustic grand piano, you'll notice that the three pedals respond differently and require different pressures to depress them. This is due to the different mechanical parts they're operating inside the piano. Now Yamaha has included their GP response damper pedal mechanism, which is designed to replicate the feel and response of a grand piano's damper pedal. And this provides variable resistance, meaning the pedal responds differently depending on how much pressure is applied. And that's just like an acoustic grand piano. Advanced players can, of course, use half pedaling techniques as well. The combination of the very best keyboard and pedaling systems Yamaha has ever made available in a Clavinova digital piano makes the CLP885 an excellent choice for pianists who are looking for an acoustic-like experience, but with all the features and convenience of a digital instrument. For many years now, Yamaha Clavinova pianos have featured the voices of two of the world's most renowned grand pianos, the Yamaha CFX and the Bosendorfer Imperial. 
Now the Yamaha CFX is known for its bright and powerful sound and exceptional clarity and resonance, making it ideal for a wide range of musical genres. On the other hand, the Bosendorfer Imperial has a warm, sort of lush tone and it's distinctly different to the CFX. I find the Bosendorfer is perfect for classical compositions and expressive performances. One thing I have noticed, however, is that the CFX piano voice seems to have been improved since it was introduced to the Clavinova CLP500 series back in 2014. Although it may still have the same name, the CFX sound you hear in the modern Clavinova digital pianos is richer and fuller bodied than anything you might have heard before. When listening to these piano examples, you may have heard a feature that you didn't even know existed called grand expression modeling. Now this technology makes digital pianos feel and sound more like real grand pianos. When playing a piano, you should be able to hear and feel the subtle differences in sound depending on how hard or soft you press the keys. Now grand expression modeling captures those nuances so it responds just like an acoustic grand piano would when you play. It recreates the intricate details of how the hammers, strings and pedals all interact just like a real piano, making the experience more realistic and expressive. The CLP885 also has Yamaha's improved virtual resonance modelling known as VRM, which enhances the realism of digital piano sounds by replicating the complex resonances and interactions between the different notes, strings and soundboard found in acoustic pianos. When you press a key on an acoustic instrument, not only does that string vibrate, but it also causes sympathetic vibrations in other strings and the soundboard, which creates the rich kind of resonant tone that we all associate with acoustic pianos. Now Yamaha's improved VRM simulates these interactions, which again allows for a more dynamic playing experience. It takes into account factors like timing and intensity of key presses and pedal usage, and generates authentic reverberations and tonal variations. And this results in a more natural and immersive sound and it closely mimics the experience of playing a high quality grand piano. Many people invest in a digital piano not only because there is minimal ongoing maintenance that you might expect with an acoustic instrument, but also because they need to make use of the convenience of being able to practice silently using headphones. The CLP885 features binaural samples of the Yamaha CFX and Bosendorfer pianos. Now, binaural sampling is a method of recording the sound of a piano using special microphones placed on a mannequin's head in the same positions as the pianist is to capture piano sounds the way that they would actually sound. This makes pianists feel as though they are sitting at a grand piano even when they play with the headphones on. And the experience is intended to be so pleasant that they forget they're wearing their headphones, no matter how long they continue to play the piano. And I must say that it works, because playing the CLP885 with a good quality set of headphones for longer periods of time is still a very pleasant experience. In addition to having lots of excellent onboard acoustic piano voices, the CLP885 offers a choice of 53 voices plus 14 drum and sound effects kits. There are also 480 voices in the additional XG bank, which are useful for making good use of the onboard 16 track recording feature, but more of that a bit later. Any two of the panel voices can be layered together in dual voice mode or split across the keyboard so you can play different sounds using left and right hands independently.
CLP885 is available in three different cabinet finishes, black walnut, high gloss polished ebony or polished white. The design of the cabinet differs slightly from the previous models with these slightly curved end cheeks which have a design nod to acoustic upright pianos. There's a nice long 84 cm music desk with four clips to hold the pages of your books open and overall the cabinet shape is akin to that of an acoustic upright piano. The built-in speaker system is very powerful at 230 watts and multiple speakers are located around the piano's cabinet to amplify the sound throughout the instrument. Yamaha has used their experience of creating premium hi-fi amplifiers and speakers and added speaker diffusers, waveguides and bi-directional horns which take advantage of sound reflected from the walls and the piano itself to enhance the overall sound. You must really hear this piano in person to appreciate how good it sounds. Like other models in the CLP series, the CLP885 features an onboard recorder. You can use it to record your piano performance or you can take things a little further and create a 16 track composition that contains a full range of instruments, including orchestral voices, synth sounds and drum kits. Using the recorder is a very simple procedure, just select a voice, press record and start playing. Press the record button again to end the recording and then save your music as directed on the display screen. The CLP885 has a memory that can save up to 250 songs or you can store an infinite number of recordings to an external USB storage device as either MIDI or audio data. I like to use the multi-track feature to record the sound of orchestral and percussion instruments that I can then use as a backing track for my piano performance. So here's a very quick demonstration of how you can make use of this simple but powerful feature. First choose a voice and in this example I'm choosing a slow orchestral string sound. Press record, switch on the metronome and set the tempo. Press play to begin recording. I like to leave a blank metronome bar when recording more than one track as I find it helps with my timing. Press record to end the recording, save your recording and make a note of the song name. Now choose the second voice you want to record. I'm going to choose the orchestral percussion drum kit. Switch on the metronome, press play to begin recording. Play the second part you wish to record. Press record to end the recording and save the song again. You can now play back your recorded parts and play along using the piano. This was a very simple example of the multi-track recording facility, but of course you can record up to 16 different instruments to create a much more complex backing track, including drums, bass, guitars, brass, and many other voices. It's a really great feature and can be lots of fun. 
The CLP885 is equipped with Bluetooth audio and MIDI capabilities. Now, Bluetooth audio is for streaming sound to or from the piano. It's particularly useful if you're using a smart device to play along to your favorite music video while hearing the sound of the backing through the CLP885's powerful speaker system. Bluetooth MIDI transmits performance data and enables communication with interactive learning and composing apps, including FlowKey. Now, Flowkey is a really good app for learning piano. Yamaha offers three months of free access when you buy a Clavinova digital piano here in the UK. The CLP885 is, of course, compatible with the Yamaha Smart Pianist app, which allows users to control their Yamaha digital piano using the touchscreen of a smart device. You can use the app to adjust settings, select voices, and operate the recording function. The app also includes a wide range of built-in songs and sheet music. The Smart Pianist app really makes learning, practicing and performing more interactive and enjoyable and it's completely free. So that brings me to the end of my Yamaha CLP885 buyer's guide and I hope you've enjoyed watching as much as I've enjoyed playing this piano. There's no doubt that the CLP885 is the very best CLP Clavinova series piano Yamaha has ever produced. The improvement in the keyboard action makes this instrument even more appealing than the models that came before it. And the high quality speaker system really does justice to the incredible CFX piano voice. If you're in the market for a premium range digital piano, then I think the CLP885 should definitely be on your shortlist. And it's worth taking a trip to Bonner's Piano Centers so you can have the treat of experiencing this piano for yourself. As always, if you have any questions about choosing the right digital piano for your needs, or if you would like to test the latest models from all the top manufacturers, then please give me or any of the team at Bonners a call. We're here to help you make the right decision. Thanks very much for watching.